Welcome to Kemendaya's Farm. I'm happy to announce to you all that we're starting a new episode. This title, the A to Z of running and starting a pig farm in Nigeria. <laughs> okay, yeah, because we're in Nigeria. So is uh, we're going to be sharing with you the A to Z of starting and running a pig farm in Nigeria. In this episode, we're going to be talking about everything you need to know about pig farming and in today's episode which is episode one i'm going to be sharing with you the first thing you need to do when you want to start a pig farm Let's, what is the first thing you need to do when you are thinking of starting a pig farm is your location if you want to start a pig farm the first thing you think about here would be the best location for me to start my farm and now why is location very important? Location, location is very important because it affects the business. Yes, it affects the business, the location. So it's very, very, very important. That is why the first thing you must consider when you are thinking of starting a pig farm is the location where you want to set up your farm. That is the first thing you must think about. Where is the best location for me to set up this farm? The things you must consider when you want to choose the location to set up your pig farm. That is what I will be sharing with you in this video. What are the things do I need to look out for when I'm looking for a good location that I can set up my farm? And also share with you why location is also important and also some of the disadvantages of not having a good location for your farm. I have to consider when I'm choosing a location for my pig farm. This is it. The first thing you must consider is accessibility. Think about the accessibility of the place. You want to inquire that land. Is it easily accessible for people to get to this place? That is the number one thing you must think about. Is it easily accessible? Then is the road good? Is it motorable? The road to this, this land, is it motorable? Do you understand? Then the next thing you ask yourself, the next thing you ask yourself, is the place secured? Security is very important. You don't want to set your farm in a community where S men are attacking or you know, where a, a, a community that is not secure, that they are always at fight, that uh, that there's always fight, community fight, and then you see they'll come and burn up your pig farm, right? So you must think of security. In any place you want to get a property to set up your pig farm, you must think of what security. So what did I say? Accessibility is key. Is it is is this place easily is, is it motorable? You understand? Is the road good? And then security. How secure is this community I want to set up my pig farm? Now this is it. If you want to choose a location for your pig farm, please make sure your farm is not too far from the road. Don't put your farm inside a forest. Your farm shouldn't be too far from the road so that people can easily access your farm. It shouldn't be too far from the road. That is the number one thing you must consider. Your farm shouldn't be too far from the road. It shouldn't be too far from the major road. In that community you want to set up a farm. It shouldn't be too far from the major road. This is very, very important. Like I said earlier, because if your farm is inside, inside the community, like inside foreigns, I'm telling you, customers will complain and it will affect your customer base. You, because they, they can't easily assess you. They can't easily get to you. You know? So most times, even if they want to come to you, when they consider how far your farm is, they will just branch the next person that is not too far from the road. Do you understand? So don't go and get a farm inside one village, inside one forest. Please, your farm shouldn't be too far. At most, let's say at, at least your farm should be like maybe 15 minutes drive from the major road. Yes. That is, if it's very far, if your farm is very far, 15 to 20 minutes drive from the major road is okay. Anything more than that is tool inside, please. It's tool inside. Your farm shouldn't be more than 15 to 20 minutes drive from the major road. 
no matter how bad it is it shouldn't be more than that so when you are choosing a location for your pig farm you must consider this is a must I'll, I'll tell you this there are people who their farms they are inside inside like a forest they will tell you what they are experiencing in their farm customers cannot cannot get to them easily and then when those the few customers that will come they will start telling you they will start surprising rubbish because they know that customers cannot come to you easily so so you, you cannot like you know you, you because you want to sell now you know ah, this customer that managed to come i should go and lose this customer this one that this place is very far i don't know if another customer will come oh, the road is not even good please don't put yourself in that mess a lot of farmers that made this mistake they regretted it they have to move their pig farm location so don't put yourself in that mess if you want to start up a pig farm please make sure you choose a good location for your pig farm make sure the place is not is, is not um more than 50 to 20 minutes drive from the major road make sure the road is accessible very 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 important you will thank me later if you put this into consideration before getting a location for your pig farm nice of um profitable pig farm training you know i remember he shared the story with us uh, back then you know during uh one of the, the training when i attended one of the training back then years back he shared a, a story about the first place he set up his farm like inside forens inside forens the place the farm is it was so far from the road there's no electricity the road is even bad like the road to get to that to to get the farm is is bad and he was telling us that do you know that like i don't if i should share what we passed through when the farm was in that location when customers come they will start doing chakara they will start rising rubbish why because you, they, they, you, for people to get to you is so difficult so when they manage to come you don't want to lose them you just want to sell off especially when your animals are ready for you to sell and then you manage to see a customer when you are not sure of when the next one will come because of how bad the road is and how far your pig farm is so you see when customers just come like this they just have to sell they don't have a choice they will price rubbish but they just they end up selling most of the time they end up selling most of the time because of the location of the farm and they have to relocate from that place that is the truth because they can't continue they have to relocate from that place it was just too far from the road too far it's just too far from the road and it affected the business they have to relocate from that place they have to move to a new site so you have to learn from other people's mistake you don't have to wait to make that mistake you, you have to learn from the mistake others have made. So if you are thinking of starting a pig farm, please sit down, relax and watch this video to the end. Uh, I mean, make sure you follow every episode as I will be dropping them every week. Like I said, it's A to Z of starting and running a pig farm in Nigeria. Practical, like this is from experience. You understand? And also other experience gathered from other people is what we'll be sharing with you in this episode so don't miss any of this episode and i said like in today's episode we have talked about location location is very very important please the first thing you must think about when you want to set up your pig farm is the location make sure you get a good location make sure your farm is not more than 15 to 20 minutes drive from the major road please don't go and look for buy a land in a very thick forest very cheap that you now be having issues please you must think about that get a good location that is no more than 50 to 20 minutes drive from the road and also make sure the road is good the road is accessible and that the community is what is secured make sure the community is secured and then also make sure that there is water that is a good land that has water very 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 important because you need water you know there are some land there's no water even if there's water there's no clean water so make sure that there is water because you cannot run a pig farm without water these animals need water to grow well so you must make sure that there's water in that place there's clean water that you can get clean water in that land then that the road is good is accessible 
and then the, the community is secured. You don't want to uh, you don't want to set up a farm somewhere and then the next thing that they are fighting and they are burning things and they don't come and burn down your farm. Oh, it will not make customers not to come to your farm because there is war in the community. So customers will not come to your farm. Right? So please, these are the things you uh, this is why. So like I said, uh, I'm going to tell you uh, why location is important. Location is important. Now, this is it. Location is important because if your farm is more than uh, 20 minutes drive from the road, is a problem. It will make customers not to come to you easily. They will choose other options over you, even if your product are good and if it's cheap. That is the advantage why right? location is important. With a good location, it will make it, it, will, it will be easy for with a good location that the road is accessible, the community is secure, it will, it, it's going to it will be easy for customers to come to you. You don't have problems. Even if one customer come and is prizing rubbish, you can tell them to leave your farm because you know that people and it, uh, it's easy for people to just walk into your farm. Uh, another customer will come so you don't have to worry that ah, one will like to see another customer that will come to this forest to come and meet us right because the farm is easily accessible so another customer will come so you can say please leave we're not selling like that right so you if your farm is not too far from the road people can easily get to you customers can easily get to you and they will not come to your farm and be pricing rubbish or be doing shakara for you because they know that if they should leave somebody else will come because your farm is very accessible. Now, this is the disadvantage, like I said earlier. If your farm is far from the road and it's not easily accessible, these customers will come and they will price rubbish. They will start doing chakara for you because your farm is what is not easily accessible and it will affect your business. And I believe you don't want that. So you have to learn from mistakes other people have made. So I hope with this, um, I hope this video uh, made some sense to you. I hope you learned something. I hope it's an high up now for you. You know, I believe with all I've said, we have seen why location is very, very important that you must consider a good location for your for your pig farm. You must make sure that it's accessible. It's not more than 15 to 20 minutes drive from the major road. And also that the community is secure, the place is secure, and that the land is good, it has good water. And then also the road so your farm is also good that is very very accessible so this is it uh in our next episode uh by next week we'll be dropping a new episode like i said it's the a to z of starting and running a pig farm in nigeria that is what we're going to be talking about in this episode so i believe this episode one is um very enlightening for you like i mean you have learned something new that you have never thought of before you know so please think about this and for those of you if you know the location of your farm is very very far it's more than 20 minutes drive from the road on 30 minutes drive from the major road and the road to your farm is not easily accessible please you need to consider changing location you can sell off that space and get a new place please change location I believe you agree with me that the location of your farm is actually affecting you in terms of price that you are selling and you know the level of customer that comes to your farm right so please you can think of changing location yeah other people that made the mistake they actually changed location so you can think of changing a location get a new land set up a new place i know it's not easy but if you want to be in this business for years and pass it to the next generation then you must consider changing a location so for those of you that haven't start, started that's why i said this video is for you it's for new farmers uh farmers, it's for uh, aspiring farmers you know uh, those looking at going into pig farming this episode where i started a to z of running and starting a pig farm is for you make sure you don't miss it follow us on our social media pages for hub day on facebook is commendaius farm and uh, on instagram is commendaius farm and here on youtube is commendaius farm please like and also click on the notification bell also so that anytime we post videos you can get the update immediately you don't want to miss any episode at all so i believe today episode talking about location and why location is important i believe you learned something from it and uh, now you can start on your first 
your you can take your checklist and on location and then considering your location and making the right decision so that you don't choose a wrong location so see you all next week bye please share this video with your friends and other groups you belong to